right decision in your eyes then? Uh, the, the, the referees deemed the goalkeeping areas dangerous and one or two little patches out there. Um, I think it was difficult to turn and stop, so you know we, we go by the referee's decision and uh, and you know fair enough this happens. I think the frost has caught everyone out and uh, and we'll have to go again. A bit frustrating for you, but frustrating for Fleetwood as well, travelling all the way down. If here. I'm honest, I think Fleetwood have, uh, have had the bigger upheaval, you know, and uh, and, and obviously their fans. But um, I feel for for our fans as well, you know, they're good fans and and obviously um, <coughs> they were looking forward to a game today, as were we. But we uh, we professionals, we prepare right for. Uh, for Exeter on New Year's Day and we go again, so this happens and, uh, and that's the word professional again, that's what you've got to use. Is it a blessing in disguise in a way that you can now prepare for the Exeter game, you've got more time to prepare for it? One or two little knocks, so uh, it's, uh, but you know, it, it's, uh, it, either way, uh, it, it would have been fine with me and, uh, and you know, the lads, the lads were ready to play, so, but unfortunately, like I say, last minute call off and uh, we have to live with that. It must have been frustrating, the, the amount of uncertainty, I think the ref turned up at 12 o'clock and initially called it off, is, is, that, is that correct? Uh, I'm not sure, he didn't mention, he didn't call it off officially until until the time he did, you know, and he saw it, you know, discussions going on for everyone and I think uh, there was the chance that it could have been on, but um, you know, the, the late call is, uh, is, is the one the referee wants and, uh, and we've got to stand by that. Yeah, yourself and Graham must have wanted the, the, the game to carry on though, um, you, you must have been uh, trumping at the bit to uh, to get out there and uh, put... You always want to play, you know, you don't want to fix your congestion but it, you know, it can't be helped if the frost has caught everyone out then, uh, then it's one of those things that caught me out, I didn't realise that it was going to be frosted this morning when I woke up and uh, and obviously it's, uh, it's took a toll on the pitch so like I say one of those things, it's, uh, it's just football and we'll have to get on with it.